everybody welcome back to this channel today I am doing something a little bit different for you guys I've never done one of these videos but but today I am doing my first ever meal prepping video I cooked four different dishes for you guys and they're all prepped and ready to go into the freezer I am so happy that I did this guys I'm so happy they're done because now I don't have to worry about dinners or lunches for the rest of the week I am so happy so I guess I will stop rambling and we'll get straight into this video so the first dish we are cooking, we are doing a Thai beef kind of stir fry. So first of all, I am just cutting up some onions into like little like cubes, like so I can fry them up and make them all crispy. So once I've cut up all my onions, I just put them in the pan and I am not making them crispy, I am making them soft. So we're just going to soft the onions. So it gives our dish a little bit of flavour. Once the onions are all softened, we're just going to put our mince in. You can use any mince you like, but I obviously am using beef mince this time. And I just put it in the pan until it is brown enough to put all of the other ingredients in. So once the meat is all brown, I just put all the other ingredients in. So I put a piece of corn, a little bit of salt, my rice, and then the last thing I put in is just the Thai beef sauce, which is from Celebrity Health. And then you just want to mix it in, combine it all together, and then the dish is done. This dish is so super easy and simple to make. And I'm so glad I have it in my fridge ready to go. On to the next dish. I am making some Moroccan lamb meatballs. And first of all, we're just going to make some sweet potato chips. So I'm just cutting up two sweet potatoes because they are going to be used in two different meals. And then I'm putting some oil on them and just some Moroccan spices on them. And then they're just going in the oven to obviously fry. And then I'm going to just chop up my other vegetables. So I'm chopping up my corn and my Brussels sprouts ready to be softened in the microwave. And then we're going to go on to the meatballs. So with the meatballs, I'm putting a little bit of cumin and um, turmeric in it. And then I also put a little bit of Italian herbs and some barbecue sauce and tomato sauce. Once that is all mixed in, you're just going to put a little bit of oil on your pan and then just make little meatballs and cook them up. So once all the other vegetables are cooked up, I'm just going to brown off my Brussels sprouts in the pan and make them all nice and crispy. The next dish is super, super easy, guys. First of all, I'm just going to cut off all my asparagus ready to be fried, and then I'm just going to place all my fish fillets that I want to place into a pan of butter. And I've already cooked my sweet potato fries as I showed you them before in the Moroccan lamb dish. And then, easy as pie, I just shove my asparagus into the same pan that I'm cooking my fish, fry them off, and then put them in the containers. Lucky last dish. So, the last one I'm cooking is just a tuna mornay. So I'm just going to quickly put some pasta into a big pot of water, let it boil and let the pasta cook through. So once the pasta is cooked through, I obviously remove the water and then I put everything in it. So I'm putting tuna in it, I'm putting peas and corn and I'm obviously putting my little sachet for the seasoning. 
then you just gotta mix it through and make it sure it's all combined and all cooked through and it is done. It is that simple, guys. King is done, guys. Oh my god, look at all this food. Doesn't it look amazing? So I've got four dishes of my Thai beef, um, like stir fry kind of thing. I've got four dishes of my lamb meatballs with like vegetables. I've got four dishes of fish and chips with asparagus, and I've got six dishes of. Um, tuna morning. So I hope you all enjoyed this video. I enjoyed filming this because I have never filmed one of these videos before. I've done cooking videos before with you guys. I've done, you know, what I eat in the day videos, but nothing like this. It was actually quite intense to make sure that I was cooking everything right and I was showing you guys how to cook it, make sure I'm like telling you guys like what is going on and everything like that. But I actually really enjoyed it. So hopefully I will try and do these every like fortnight or so. But I all but it all depends on you guys. If you guys don't like it, then I won't do it anymore. But hopefully you guys like it so I can keep on doing these. But I'm really excited. So I'm going to get going so I can put all this stuff in my freezer now. So I hope you all enjoyed. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up and also subscribe if you're not already. And I guess we'll see you all in my next video. Bye.